Hey hello everybody, this is AJ here. I want to give you a little walk around of our 1893 hose carriage. We just got it out of the Frederick County Historical Museum. We're going to get ready to take it down to Crisfield, Maryland this coming weekend for the National Hard Crab Derby. This will be our 60th year in a row pulling the hose reel carriage through the parade down there. This thing t really technically never had a name but it's now called Romeo because we took the toolbox here off the old steamer pumpers from back in the late seven I'm sorry in the back in the late 1800s we had two twin steam pumpers named Romeo and Juliet well during a big fire here in the here in Frederick City the steam pumper broke loose from where it was parked and it ran down a street and rolled off the Water Street Bridge here in Frederick City the only thing we were able to salvage from it was the toolbox and these lanterns. So they end up mounting it on this hose carriage. So we now call this thing Romeo. But I've been pulling this thing ever since I was a member, 16 years old, but also been around this my whole life. I've been around this firehouse for almost 40 years. We just had this uh, redone about 10 years ago. We took it up to this place up in Burdenhand, Pennsylvania to the Amish people and if we're going to get a um, carriage rehab we're gonna take it to the people who know what's up and a little quick story is about 30 some years ago when they took it to get rehab the first time they took it to the carriage people up in Pennsylvania and when we took it back to get it redone recently the the, the son of the guy who did it years ago redid it for us so that was uh, pretty neat but anyways this is the rest of the independent host company we've all seen tower one I've posted many videos of that this is the ATR truck it's what we take on the mountain rescues it's got all the technical rescue equipment in it 18 Tanker one the Peterbilt the 95 Peterbilt And then this is new 19 11 sitting outside this is 12. The Seagrave. And a little quick fact is the independent host company is Maryland's oldest continuous operating fire department since 1818. A lot of fire departments started before us, but they disbanded and then they restarted. But we're the continuous operating. We never disbanded since 1818. People always want to give us trouble about that. But if they want to get technical, the Frederick City actually had a fire department back in the late 1700s when they bought the first hand pumper called the Grandfather. All right, well, thank you all for enjoying my video. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up and a like. And thank you all for watching my videos and giving nice comments. 
Have a good day.